Moving to a different country is very, very hard. I know, I've experienced it my own. Some people don't know how hard it is to leave everything you had behind for a completely different life. New school, new friends, new house, and of course, new language. Imagine, you're in a plane ready to move to a new country with, some, with nothing but your family and some of your stuff. How would you feel? Scared? Nervous? Sad? No, no, no. You'd feel excited about moving house and you'll meet new people that will accept you and you'll make new friends and have new experiences. Firstly, I was 11 years old when I first moved to England. I was like a child in a candy store. I wanted to explore every part of the town I lived in. But when I started school, I experienced a lot of bullying from people that were supposed to be my friends. But I found a way to get out of the reality for some days or even hours and to help my English a bit more. Watching videos in English and reading books online or even just articles in magazines. You know, some of you may say, oh, but reading is so boring. And yes, yes, I see why you say that. But think of how many things reading can teach you. It can extend your vocabulary and your imagination. Plus, if you read stories with some pictures in them, you can get attached to the characters and feel the emotions they can have sometimes. This works the best if you read books online, just saying. But look at me now. I'm 14 years old and I'm writing and reading in English like a pro. Okay, not really, but you know. So kids, the lesson is that reading can lead you to amazing things in life and can make you a happier and better person. So when you are free, go make yourself a cup of tea and start reading a book. Trust me, after you get to the exciting part, you'll be obsessed with the book. Okay, bye.